Keith King retired from Pacific Power 22 years ago. How old are you, Keith? 84. How'd you get that old? <laughs> Don't die. <laughs> When Keith was born in the 1930s, people 65 and older made up about 5% of the population. That has changed. The average county in Oregon has about 15%, 15 point something percent of people 65 and over. In uh, Klamath County, it's 18 point something percent. U.S. Health and Human Services projections say that by 2030, one out of every four people will be 65 or older. While everyone is different, there may be some common denominators in folks that just tend to age more gracefully than others. Keith King volunteers and he's active in service work, and he gets up and gets out regularly. I just eat about whatever I want to eat. I can tell by the size of me, but anyway, I, and I, I walk what I can for exercise. Experts say that that community connection is a key to staying happy and healthy. If you can maintain your self-esteem, stay connected, your health and your attitude will be better, you'll live longer. A key part of getting old is staying active and involved with the community. We asked Keith King if his focus on physical, emotional, or spiritual elements plays the most important role. A combination of all three, I think. And I'm, I'm not a real religious person, but I sure think there's something up there that's above us. I do believe that, and I, and I talk to it. Not worrying may also be adding years to Keith's life. He's out in the community. He has a strong support system. He has a very positive view on life. I can tell from what you've shown me that he has a sense of humor. I think that's extremely important. He's living life. He's living it to the fullest. Um, he doesn't care. He really doesn't. Life is life. And what, that's what I like because I want to get to that point. Having a positive attitude may be the closest thing there is to a fountain of youth. Aging is inevitable, but getting older is a choice. So it really has nothing to do with age. It's a, it really is a state of mind. And Keith King's attitude of gratitude is infectious. It's been a good life, and I know one of these days I'll go, but I, I'm just grateful how much I've had of it. And I hate to read people in the paper all the time that are past known that are my friends, but that's just life when you get old. In Klamath Falls, Lyle Ahrens, NBC2 News.